Okay, so I just finished my other fingernail and it turned out very nicely. Can you see that? So now I'm going to show you that was with white underneath. I'm going to show you what to do with nothing underneath, okay? So make sure your cup is cleared if you already have done this. And so I'm just going to clean that out. It's actually very cool even to clean it out, I think, because it just comes right off, which is definitely cool. Okay, so now I am going to take my colors. I'm going to add orange to this one. I think that will be cool. And I am going to make sure you're doing this fast now. And your water needs to be room temperature. About. So, all lids are off and ready to go. Now, if you don't have a lot in the bottle, you might have to, pre like, dump it almost. So, go ahead and start. Make sure you have a toothpick nearby because you're going to have to stir it and make an awesome design inside. Drop it in. It, the first color, watch. See if it's going to sink. And if you see it coming back up, you can go ahead and move on to your next color. But if it's not coming back up, then you have to put another drop in. Now that's interesting. I've never had that done, happen before. They're both singing. Okay. That's happened before. I've never had one where it just kind of sat in the middle right there. Okay. That's good. See how it's starting to, you don't have to close them like I just did, so, as soon as you're done. See the green's coming back up and it's about to, yep, there we go. My orange, kind of sunk a little, yep, there it goes, it's stuck to the surface. Okay, and last but not least, my blue. Okay, so take your toothpick and just make a design that you think is cool. You might want to cover your finger with tape. It all depends on what you feel. I did cover my finger last time, but this time I'm not going to cover it. Okay, so apparently I'm getting orange and blue this time. See, not always will it come out perfectly the way you want it. So you just have to play, pick a place where you think the design will come out cool. Stick your finger in there and leave it for just a few seconds. It's not going to take that long. Okay, and then pull it out and you can see it's definitely not as obvious as this one but it's still very pretty no two of these are going to come out the same so if you found a design you really like well you're going to have to just admire that finger because you're not going to get another one like that most likely I mean I'm sure it's happened before but this is it's just a unique thing so the two are the same. They might look the same. But I highly doubt it's the same. Okay, so now I'm going to show you what I like to do with other colors than white and non colored. Okay, so I'll just take that out. Now I think I'm going to do orange, blue, and red. All different on these fingers, okay? So I'm going to start with my red since I haven't done red before. And this is a very bright pink, if you can see that. Very bright. I like it. Then I'm going to use a darker color to contrast with it. So just a few drops will do more than enough for this. And I have tried dipping more than one finger in. It doesn't turn out as well as you think, but if you are definitely in a hurry, you can do that. So you might wanna, that looks cool. And again, I didn't wrap my finger, but the next finger I think I will. So just dip that in and leave it there for a few seconds and then pull it out and see if you can see that. To clean up around the edges. Q-tips, cotton balls, tissues work perfect for this. It doesn't really matter. Everything works. Just this has fingernail polish remover on it. Just clean up around the edges. So you can see that. Okay. 
See, and it's dry too. It just came out and it's dry, which I think is amazing. Maybe you don't. But... Okay, so now cleaning out the red. Real simple. And going for my orange. But first, I'm going to wrap my finger. Very easy to do this. Just use clear, transparent tape. You can get it pretty much anywhere. I mean, I'm sure you have some. But just wrap it around your finger. Make sure you get up by your nail, too. Although, if you're like what we have, we don't usually have transparent tape. So, because everybody uses it. Just be careful, you don't want to get it stuck on other fingers, too. I mean, it comes right off, but there is a chance you'll pull it off with the nail polish. Okay, so on to my orange. Let's see, orange. And I'm just going to put a few drops in. And it looks like I might get a little red, which that's going to turn out really cool. And you can use the other side, definitely, of the toothpick, too. And just, if you don't want it on your hand, just be careful. And dip it in. And pull it out. See? That's cool. And just take the tape off. It comes off pretty easy. I mean, it's not terribly hard to get off. It might get stuck, but just have patience, it'll come off. And if you don't do this fast enough, it may turn into a skin-like substance which is it's kind of gross but interesting at the same time I can show you that I have a yellow that I mean sometimes if your nail polish is too old or the water isn't great then it might not work great okay so here's a yellow I'll put a drop in and just wait a minute and it will turn into that skin-like substance you have to do it this fast like you have to put your fingernails in or else it will like turn into this skin like substance it looks like it already has because it's not dispersing very fast so while I'm waiting for that to go I'll just wrap my next finger real quick this is just a demonstration you do not have to um, do this yellow definitely not but see how it's not going like dispersing like all my other colors have that means it's turning into that skin like so, and that's like, when it turns into that skin, it's like what I've been pulling off the top of the surface after my finger's been in there. So, which that's very interesting. Okay, it's definitely done. See, you can see there's like a clear coming off the top, if you can see this. Now it's dispersing a little bit. Because there was a clear almost around it. I mean, you can get a clear even though you haven't used clear nail polish which I find that kind of interesting. So this yellow is about done already. See, there's a more clear around the edges of this. And this yellow is coming right off. See, it's a, kind of an old nail polish or the how it was made just doesn't mix, like what it's made out of doesn't mix with the water temperature. So last but not least, I'm going to do a little blue on my last pink nail. And you can choose any colors. It's definitely on your personality and how you feel about colors. Okay, so there's my blue. Just wipe off one of these. You don't need a new one every time. Definitely not. So you can definitely stir it a little bit. Get a little design almost in there. Add some more. However you feel about it. Yep, I've got some of my other fingernail. That looks sweet. Okay. See, and then just dip it in for a few seconds. You only need a few seconds, and then pull it out. And you can see it almost turned purple because of the blue and its contrast. Just take off the tape. Watch. Normally, I'm just going to tell you this. Normally, it's going to be water splashing off of you. At well, not off of you. At you. And that is not fingernail polish, but be careful because sometimes you might get a little surprise with fingernail polish with the water. So, 
because obviously you just dipped your finger in nail polish and water so you're gonna have some water through there and sometimes it gets a little stuck you just have to be very careful and just kind of get that off of there and there you go maybe clean it up yeah, I don't need to clean that up so sometimes you can just use your other fingernails and clean it there but it had already hardened so I couldn't clean it from my other fingernails okay so there you go the white underneath nothing underneath pink the, all three of these have pink and this one has a dark red darker red underneath or on top this one ring finger had a little bit of orange and my pinky had some blue so thank you for watching and please be ready for more videos thank you